Good afternoon, I'm Stephanie Strand here at the end of the morning session at General Council 43 in Oshawa, Ontario. I'm here with Reverend Kimberly Heath, the president of Bay of Quinty Conference, one of the co-hosts of General Council 43 along with All Native Circle Conference. Kimberly, what has your experience been at this General Council? It's been an amazing experience, I think, on a, on a, a few levels. One of them is being co-hosting co with the All Native Circle. That's been a really rich thing for us to do. Uh, it, I think it makes for a, a different kind of general council, mm -hmm. and it's been uh, very rich that way. Doing important business uh, makes it uh, an interesting general council. Um, and, uh, and the other sort of sub-theme has been, surely God is in this place, help me notice. And I've sure noticed that it's not just been business, that there's been a real sense of the presence of God mm -hmm. and faith in this place. So it's been awesome. That's, that's really great to hear. I'm really glad that you, you've noticed that presence of God here. So as, as a co-host of General Council, have you noticed that there's more responsibilities or a different sense of it rather than just acting as a commissioner here? Oh yeah, <laughs> it's it's you know that you, you, you always have to be on your toes. There's always something changing up or something to do, and uh, a lot of the time it's stuff that you didn't imagine that you needed to do. There's a lot involved in you know it's kind of like the I don't know the support structure for a building or you know the bottom of the iceberg. Mm -hmm. Base that's a better illustration. You've got this tiny little iceberg that most people see, but the massive part under the water that goes into organizing this from the volunteers to the business table to, to everything. So there's just a huge amount of organization. And I think always there's always hiccups, but I think it's gone really overall very smoothly. Mm -hmm. And working with All Native Circle Conference, do you think that this sort of change is really bringing you any sort of excitement for the new regional changes that are coming in? What are you looking forward to in, in working in a regional structure? Do you know one of the things that I found with the old structure, with the conferences, is that the walls between conferences seemed impermeable. They just seemed like I live on the edge of Bay of Quinty. If I lean east, I'm in Montreal, Ottawa mm -hmm. conference, and I don't know anybody when just slightly east of me. And my hope for the new structure is that some of these walls will come down and that we will work inter-regionally. And I think this conference was a fantastic example of how we can work throughout the regions. I would love to see future general councils co-host with All Native Circle. It's one of the things that we are passionate about as, as a church, that we work together with, with uh, the Indigenous peoples of Canada. And uh, I would love to see more co-hosting in the future with different regions. So yeah, I'm, I'm really hopeful. Oh, good. I'm, I'm so glad to hear that. So like I said, we're just heading into the afternoon session of the last day of General Council 43. So what are your final thoughts as we're heading into the final decision making? Well, I mean, you know, hoping it's all going to come together. I think it will. This, this morning was sort of hopeful with a new process and mm -hmm. that uh, fancy new clicker gadget that we're, uh, we're busy using. Uh, it's been an amazing conference. That's, that's, I, I guess those are my final thoughts. I think a lot of us are kind of ready to be done with the business and, and, and heading home, but it's been incredibly rich and wonderful. Thank you so much for joining me today, Kimberly. It's been, it's been great to speak with you.